Why do we keep doing this? A few months ago, we dressed up in camo, hid in the woods, and surprised our friends at their off-grid cabin. We developed an addiction to the intense anticipation right before the surprise and the extreme <laughs> happiness right after. An opportunity came up to surprise again, so we got our butts up, hopped on a plane, and got to it. Storing your items properly. I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out. They're almost here. Why am I so addicted to this feeling of surprising wow, people? We are so anxious right now. <laughs> the same group of best friends since I was seven years old. Life has taken us in very different directions, but we make it a point to come together at least once a year. And, <laughs> and this year the plan was to come here to Big White Mountain in British Columbia. As far as my friends know, the timing didn't work out for Tal and me this year because we're working on the van and hitting the road pretty soon. So, all we saw was an opportunity for a surprise. Big White Mountain is located in beautiful British Columbia. It boasts a whopping 7,600 feet of elevation and experiences an annual snowfall of 25 feet, making it the perfect home to Canada's largest ski in, ski out village. This was the chosen location for the annual friend reunion for a lot of reasons, but we'll get into that a little later. Right now, it's time to meet up with Colin one of our good friends and the only person that actually knows we're here. We're hopping on the gondola to make our way towards our first surprise victim. Yeah, I'll go in first and then you guys know. And we're gonna wait for him to close the door. friends Courtney and Colin bought this studio in Big White and transformed it in 30 days into this beautiful and cozy Airbnb. We'll leave the Airbnb link down below. Our beautiful friend Courtney here plans everything to a T and we love that about her. And I could not have foreseen how amazing it would be to surprise her. One of our surprises has been a success so far. We still have part two of our surprise coming. It would be good to go around the corner and you guys pop out of the trunk. Why am I so open. addicted to this feeling of surprising uh, people? So right now we are killing time in town. We're exploring. It is too cute here. Everywhere is ski in and ski out. We have totally lucked out with the weather today. It's actually t-shirt weather. We just saw somebody in shorts and a tank top. And we're going to go get some lunch now. Oh, yeah. Yes. As a seasoned surpriser, that is exactly the type of message you want before a surprise. This is actually probably my favorite cocktail, and it's a true Canadian cocktail. It's called a Caesar, similar to a Bloody Mary, but way better. <laughs> Perfect. And there's something about drinking a Caesar on a sunny day on a mountain that makes it taste 10 times better. Plan time, let's get Syria. Okay, so I agree that we should be outdoors due to the uh, velocity of screams. Scream. The screen is going to be high. It's going to be high. I think we go around a corner. They park here. We go around here. You're waiting here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Before we move any further in today's video, I wanted to chat with you about Harry's, a brand we are partnering with for the second time, all because of how well it was received by you, our incredible YouTube community. I have to admit something to you right now. Do not judge me for this, but when I was growing up, I used to steal my brother's razor to shave my legs because I always found that it was just better. On top of that, have you seen how pricey razors can be? In comes Harry's with high quality, fair price razors for anyone. Harry's offers everything you need at a factory direct price. Nothing more, nothing less. They balance quality with affordability. Their premium blades get delivered right to your door so you can count on getting a close, comfortable, and smooth shave. 
The handle is even made from 50% recycled plastic and gives you a great grip. On top of all that, Harry sets aside 1% of all sales to support nonprofits providing mental health services to those in need. Maybe now my brother will steal my razor. If you... <laughs> If you want to see what all the hype is about, click the link in the description. You'll be able to redeem your starter set for just $5. In it, you'll receive a five blade razor, weighted handle, a blade cover, and their delicious smelling foaming shave gel. Okay, back to the fun. Okay, it's go time. We are so anxious right now. <laughs> Two surprises in one day, my heart can't handle it. <laughs> Look at the view. That is not a good resting heart rate. <laughs> For reference, 60 to 100. Woo! It's going down, it's okay. I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out. They're almost here. All right, as you can see, this is a group of friends that has a really good time together. Um, we're gonna go out for some dinner, have a fun night out. We will see you on the slopes bright and early tomorrow morning. Shine your light, cast away the shadows in the night. Take a chance today, cause you know it's gonna be all right. Good morning from Big White. I woke up pretty early because I looked up at the sky at the window and the colors were changing, so I ran out. And it's so nice because there's no one around. The village is completely asleep. Shine your light. We all got fears we need to fight. Love yourself today. This part of British Columbia is three hours behind from Toronto, so I woke up quite early. But in this moment, I'm pretty grateful for that. It's also quite nice to just have a moment by yourself before you have a really busy and fun day. Let's go get ready. <laughs> ready! Woo! 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 So we're coming out of our building and the hill is right here. Through the ghosts, the cute the snow ghosts, the goblins. The goblins. That was crazy. It's In the morning, it was, the conditions weren't great, although it was so beautiful and sunny. It was super icy. And then all of a sudden it started dumping snow, which is super exciting because that means tomorrow the conditions are gonna be amazing. It was a whiteout. It was a full whiteout out yeah. there. Which is sort of dangerous because you can't see in front of you, but it also just feels incredible. And now we're taking our break because these girls haven't skied in and snowboarded in two. These girls. Three? Three years. Yeah, three years. It's been a long time. Oh, 
I feel so good. The next day, we were in fact blessed with fluffy, powdery snow. As you can see, we made a party pit stop on the hill. If you've never had a charcuterie board with a side of champagne on a mountain, well, we highly recommend putting it on your bucket list. Truly the best day of my life. <gasps> wow! With a beautiful moon down the night. This morning, we thought we would take a break from skiing, mainly because our legs don't work anymore. <laughs> the drive from Big White to Kelowna was so spectacular since you're driving from in the mountain and there's so much snow everywhere down to the valley and you just see the roads winding and the snow deteriorating and I just love that drive. It's pretty amazing because when we were up in Big White, the weather was negative six there's and now... <laughs> Cut that out, editor. Oh, it's really in there. Kidding, leave it in. Does anybody else try and get food out of their teeth this by was supposed to by be a shooting nice... saliva through your the slits? <laughs> if this is grossing anybody out, I'm sorry, but I can't get this out of my tooth. It's here. It's with me now forever. <laughs> but I just wanted to say that I think it's so amazing that you drive down an hour and the weather is totally different. There's no more snow. It's full spring. And yesterday we were in a snowy mountain. Yeah. I love it. I love being able to experience all the seasons. And we are basically just being taken on a, on a tour by our tour guides, Colin and Courtney. They're having a tour guide itinerary meeting. <laughs> this is our second coffee shop of the day. I'm not mad about it, but I might be a bit jittery pretty soon. <laughs> is it worth the second like coffee shop stop? Mm -hmm. Stop number three is top notch. It's just so cool to be here in the spring. It's nice and warm in the valley, and then you look at the mountains and they still have snowy peaks. Next stop, lunchtime. Stop number 547 on the tour of Kelowna. But this is probably the most unique restaurant I've ever seen. We're in like a little German wonderland. This is so cute. To a great weekend yeah. with great friends and love. Wow. A toast for the ages. I brought a tear to my eye. I got goosebumps still. <laughs> We just said goodbye to all of our friends. I'd really like you to repeat that for the vlog. I said this weekend would have been absolute dumb shit without you. We're having a, a nice case of the Sunday blues, but to cure those blues, we just found out that, weirdly enough, Big White is having their pride parade today. All right, wow, that was the, one of the more relaxed pride parades we've been to. <laughs> I still love the community feel that these ski towns have, mostly because a lot of people that are working in these towns come from all over the world to work the entire ski season. A lot of the times their job gets them a free season pass or something close to it. And a lot of you might know that skiing is, and snowboarding are not cheap hobbies. I guess what I'm trying to say is, if you want to do something, there's always a way to make it work, even if you might not have the means. So get out there and try it.